Hello and welcome to this first exciting session of the Make Music Pack for 7 to 9 year olds. If you want to start by having a warm up, use the Pulse and Rhythm video. You can get the link in the description to this video. In this session, we're going to have a look at multi layering some Star Wars rhythms and we're going to play the main theme from Star Wars. Find the page called Stars and Space in your Make Music book. Here are a few reminders before we start. Star Wars is in a pulse of four. So keep counting up to four in your head over and over again throughout everything that you play. Wrap your hand around the beater and keep a relaxed posture and bounce the beater off the instruments or gently scrape it across the frog scraper. Practice everything at a steady tempo. Keep practicing at this steady tempo and gradually build up the speed. It's important that you try to keep everything in a really good steady beat and keep it all flowing smoothly. Good luck. Before we play the Star Wars rhythms, have a look at the screen. Choose two of your instruments. Perhaps the lollipop drum and maybe the frog scraper. On the top line, you'll see the rhythm that says Yoda underneath it. There are two sounds to every beat. Yoda, 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 Yoda. You'll see on the first Yoda, there is something that we call an accent. This means that you give a slight force to that note. Yoda. Yoda, 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 Yoda. On the next rhythm below, you'll see some words that have three sounds to one beat. Chewbacca. It has three syllables, so that's three sounds. Chewbacca, Chewbacca, OB1. All of those rhythms have three sounds to one beat. You'll get to hear this in the score that comes up and plays in a moment. Play along with the Star Wars rhythms. You'll see the score moving on the screen in front of you in a moment. I suggest that you try the Yoda rhythm first and just play it all the way through, even though you'll hear the Chewbacca rhythm quite a lot. Try and keep the Yoda rhythm steady against this. Once you've done that, rewind the video and then try the Ren, Chewbacca, Chewbacca, Obi-Wan rhythm. Keep that going all the way through as well. You'll notice that section A to B repeats and then B has a repeated section as well. Once you've had a go at both of those rhythms, you could rewind the video again and then play them as you hear them on the video. So you get the Yoda rhythm for a bar first, then you get a number of bars of the Ren Chewbacca rhythm, and then it goes back to the Yoda rhythm at the end. Good luck and have lots of fun trying.
Star Wars has two sections of music and a short ending for you to learn. On the screen in front of you, you can see section A. It's four bars long and those four bars are repeated. The blue arrows are pointing to the repeat marks. Everything inside those gets repeated. At the very beginning of the piece, near the glasses, you can see an arrow pointing to three sounds. These get played over one beat. Count three beats rest and then play three sounds on the fourth beat and then you're into section A. Good luck trying this section. Before you start section B, remember that you can pause the video, rewind and go back and practice section A as much as you need to. Try to make sure that it's smooth and fluent and keeps in good time throughout your playing. Section B, like section A, has a repeated section. This time it's just two bars of music. Start slowly and then build up the speed. Try to keep it in really good time. Count four over and over in your head. After the repeated section, where there's a thicker arrow, you can see another two bars. This is our ending and we end on a long note C that's held for four whole beats. Good luck trying this section. Practice playing section B with the backing track. The backing track starts one beat before the letter B on the second line. The music will start on the two G's before you move into section B. Now you can play along with the whole backing track. This one goes slightly faster. Make sure again that you count yourself in and there's three beats before you start playing. The structure of the piece is that section A gets played once and then repeated and then section B gets played once and repeated and there's two bars to finish off the piece. And don't forget, you finish on a long note C. It's a semi-breathe and lasts for four whole counts. Well done. I hope you got on really well with that. If you go to the Suffolk Music Hub website and go to the Summer in a Box tab, 
You can go to the ages 7 to 9 section and pick up two links to music that you can listen to. One is an orchestra playing the Star Wars theme tune. It's a fantastic recording. Go and have a listen. And then the second recording is of a Canadian astronaut called Chris Hadfield who took his guitar into the International Space Station and plays whilst he was up there. Go and have a listen and a look at what he got up to. See you next time when we'll be looking at a sky full of stars. Bye. Thank you.